Today I am doing 13 DIY clothing life hacks that I really hope you've never seen before because I really tried hard here, okay? Okay, and tried to find some life hacks that were weird, maybe not as popular, and just one that I thought were worth putting into a video. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up for more life hack videos. And comment down below your favorite kind of life hack video or and or comment down below your favorite life hack from this video. And I'm currently having a giveaway. I'm giving away a $100 Visa gift card. The only rules are subscribe to this channel, Nicole Jacklin, and subscribe to my vlog channel. I will have them both linked down below for you guys because they're just there. So if you wanna check them out, subscribe, enter, do it. This ends on March 18th. It's international and you should go enter because it's fun. Okay, cool, great, love it. This week's winner of the post notification shout out is this person. If you want me to give you a shout out in one of my next videos, comment down below that you have turned on the bell and turned on my notifications and I will give you a shout out in one of my next videos because I just like doing that, okay? Sounds great. This video is sponsored by Gameloft. A huge thank you to them for reaching out to me because I'm so excited because I love Disney. It's amazing and they have a game called Disney Magic Kingdoms. So Disney Magic Kingdoms is really cool and you can share experiences from other characters from Tangled, Buzz Lightyear, and Mickey Mouse, etc. This game is very real life Disney World so it has all the symbolic attractions like it's a small world and Mike and Sully to the rescue. There's actually a new update on this game that is available right now and that is with Beauty and the Beast and there is a whole new outdoor ball. This is like a month long event that starts when you're watching this video. So the Beauty and the Beast mega event does start on March 9th and does run through April 3rd. This game is free to play and available in the App Store and it's linked down below by the way, so go check it out. But it's honestly so much fun and I felt like I was just reminiscing from my past because like I said, I don't live by Disney World, so it was very like, like childhood, like inclusive and it, it's amazing and I was very entertained by it and I still am, so definitely go check it out and yeah. <laughs> So yeah, anyways guys, here are my 13 DIY clothing life hacks that you have never seen before. Oh, hopefully, comment down below. I don't know, oh my god, what the heck? Okay, put it. This clothing life hack I think is so efficient, it's so good if, if you have smelly feet, because I mean, well, so if your shoes are smelly, if you have smelly feet, if you have worn your shoes without socks on, and you now have very smelly shoes, because I do that all the time and it's so bad, why? All you have to do is go take some baking soda and put that inside of your shoe, shake it around, let it set in for a while, and then dump it out, then dump out the excess, and then this is going to make your shoes last way longer and just not smell horrendous, because that's the worst thing, is knowing your shoes smell bad, and you're like, hey, sorry, my shoes are really bad, like, <laughs> You do not have baking soda. I know that tea bags also do work. Okay, this next clothing life hack will definitely save your life if you have nylons on or like tights. Whenever I wear black tights or any kind of like nylon underneath like a skirt or wherever I'm wearing my nylons, um, I always run up like a rip in my, run up a rip, run up a chick, I don't know, <laughs> in my tights. You can just take some clear nail polish and coat that over, this is the tight apparently, coat that over the tight and then it's going to stop it, to stop it from running further, or running but you know, ripping, you know, it's like the term is ripping in tights, running in tights. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> okay, this next clothing life hack is if you do not have a Razorback sports bra like I have on right now, as you can tell, you can just take a paper clip and string that between your left and your right bra straps and you have a Razorback bra strap. And honestly, if you don't have a paper clip, you can easily just take like a hair tie or any kind of tie and wrap those together. And this will just save your life because there are so many times where I'm just like, ah, I did not bring like a Razorback sports bra or whatever the heck I need one, I need one for. Okay. This next clothes this next clothing life hack has to do with how you're going to store your boots or tall shoes. Now you probably have already seen this before on many life hack videos, but you can take a pool noodle, like a half pool noodle, and put that inside of your shoe. However, it's currently March, so um I'm not sure how I'm going to just how I'm going to um present this to you guys today, but it's super simple to buy a pool noodle, but it's not in March in Michigan. So, 
Not sure about that one. Okay, this next clothing life hack is if you get gum on your clothes. This is something that I do way too often because I'm very clumsy and I can do that to myself sometimes and I'm just like, how did this happen? <laughs> sometimes you can get gum on your clothes and it's very annoying, okay, okay. So, sorry I'm being weird, I'm sorry. But you can just take clothing that you get full of gum and put this in the freezer for like a few hours and you're probably thinking why that's weird put it in like a little ziploc bag like i don't know and once it is out of the freezer you can just scrape it off and the gum will be hardened and it won't be all gooey and gross by this time and all you have to do is just pick it off and it's gonna be done out of the way My clothing life hack is how to remove scuffs from your shoes or wherever you may have scuffs on your clothing with a nail file now a nail file works way better than buying those like creams and those treatments from the store that cost like $25 at least. And they're usually not the best and most efficient things to buy to fix scuffs on your shoes. Trust me, I have purchased them and they are not that efficient. Okay, let me just tell you that. This is going to best work if you have scuffs on like a leather shoe or if you have um, like a pleather shoe, like that kind of texture of a shoe. Okay, this next life hack for your clothing is if you get shaving cream, nope, that is not the life hack. If you get makeup on your clothing, all you have to do is take some shaving cream and put that over the makeup spot, rub it in, and you have a makeupless shirt which is the best thing ever because that happens to me all the time. I always get ready and like white shirts, somehow I'm that dumb sometimes. I forget, okay? And I get makeup all over my clothes and I'm just really like, really, really, you know? Pretty sure we all have some kind of like shaving cream or if you're me and you make slime videos all the time. I have it so much, so much shaving cream, it's crazy. I just changed the lighting by doing that, smart. Okay, this next life hack is if you have a armpit stain from your deodorant, all you have to do for this is just take some baking soda. Oh, I'm like sick so I can't talk, I'm like <laughs> Let's take some baking soda and some lemon and just put that on the armpit stain, rub it in, scrub it off dub, a little scrub scrub, a little dub dub, What's wrong with me? I don't know. And then just wash this out with some water and you will have a shirt or wherever you have an armpit stain that is not your shirt because I don't know what happens sometimes. I don't even know why I'm saying this. I don't know. But this is going to be a great way to remove your armpit stains from your clothing. Well, if you want to remove that process from happening, you, this life hack I know is kind of ridiculous and kind of stupid, but if you are like presenting a paper, well actually that might go really wrong because if you're like, and now, and just flies off. So the life hack here is um, you can put a pad underneath your arm like this and, excuse me son, I'm making a video. Please stop going away. Come back. I don't know. If you can put your shirts on and have one, <laughs> what am I saying? If you can have a shirt on that's like tighter, just like secure the pad underneath your armpit and then put a shirt like looser if you want, whatever you want to dress like, I don't know, over that, then you can like secure the pad so it won't fly out when you're just, okay. So how many times do you get your zippers like for your coats stuck? They just won't zip up and you're just like, all I want to do is leave my house. In your zipper, like it will not zip up. Oh, this is the worst thing ever. I hate this. All you have to do is just take some keep of my hair today. Okay, so if your zipper is not zipping up correctly, do you, all you have to do is take a crayon and kind of just like trace that up and down the threading of your zipper, and it's going to free the zipper and make it zip, make it zip bubble, zip bubble. Okay, so how many times have you guys put on, not like, I'm like washed out. So how many times have you guys put on um, shoes and have them been super tight and just, they don't zip up, they don't like go on very well. All you have to do for this is just put your foot in your shoe and put a hair tie, a hair tie, and blow the hair dryer around your shoes. It's going to make them expand and just feel better on your feet, which is going to be amazing. This is because this will just like expand the leather and help them breathe more because especially like in new shoes with like very sturdy 
Okay, and then to eliminate the even slight chance, not guaranteed, but the slightest chance of your tights ripping, all you have to do is spray them with hairspray. So, this life hack is very swool. Very, it's very swool. It's so cool, it's swool. Love. English. <laughs> and yeah, so just take some hairspray and spray them on your tights and you'll just eliminate the chance really close to none, not totally, but like really close to none of it ripping and having it be just annoying and just feeling unprofessional and ooh. Okay, and last but not least, and not hello. <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> okay, this last life hack, it is a piece of clothing, but it's not like you're gonna wear this on your body, but kind of. Okay, the life hack here is, if you don't have, it's kind of ridiculous and I wouldn't do it, but here I am putting it in a video because me, me all the time, but you can just take a Swiffer, if you, if you don't have one of those Swiffer like cloths and you want to just like dust your place or dust your house, whatever, you can just take a fuzzy sock and put that around your Swiffer like like this and then you have this perfect way to Swiffer, Swiffer, Swiffer. All right guys, that was my 13 DIY clothing life hacks, but don't forget to go check out my giveaway and enter down below. Subscribe to this channel, Nicole Jacqueline. Subscribe to my vlog channel. Oh yeah, my vlog channel. And go turn on my post notifications because that's really fun. And yeah, okay, great, love it. Um, yeah, oh, 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 oh. But yeah, guys, leave your comments down below of your favorite life hack from this video. And comment down below that you watched the whole video. If you're still watching this video, right now. Don't forget to go check out Disney Magic Kingdoms. I will have it linked down below for you guys. It is an amazing game and thank you so much to them for sponsoring this video because that is so cool to me and I just love my job. Like this is so cool and I know that's so cool and I will never ever, I will never take that for granted that this is my job. And I, I love you guys so much. I just got home from um, LA. I'm back in Michigan now and I did so many collabs and you're gonna be so excited about them. Like there's really fun collabs coming. I'm posting one I think on Thursday and Saturday. So ooh, 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 ooh. I'm excited. You should be excited. And yeah. All right guys, I'll see you very soon. Bye.